Russia's nuclear attack on Ukraine will be considered an attack on NATO. The White House has commented on the Sunday statement by Dmitry Medvedev, the deputy chairman of the Russian Security Council, in which he once again threatened to use nuclear weapons. The White House National Security Council spokesman said the US representative called Medvedev's rhetoric reckless and irresponsible, stressing that so far Washington has not seen any signs of Russia preparing a nuclear strike. The use of nuclear weapons in Ukraine or anywhere would be disastrous for the world and would have severe consequences for Russia, the spokesperson said. He stressed that the United States continues to closely monitor the nuclear threat from Russia, but so far sees no reason to adjust its own nuclear policy. Earlier on his Telegram channel, Medvedev got scared of Ukraine's counter-offensive and wrote, Just imagine that the offensive, in tandem with NATO, succeeded and ended up with part of our land being taken away. Then we would have to use nuclear weapons by virtue of the stipulations of the Russian presidential decree, Medvedev said in the post. There simply wouldn't be any other solution, he added. Our enemies should pray to our fighters that they do not allow the world to go up in nuclear flames. Lindsey Graham, the United States senator from the Republican Party, has commented on the statement of Dmitry Medvedev. According to Graham, it is time for Russians to sober up, realize that their barbaric invasion of Ukraine is not working, withdraw and save many young Russians from a pointless death. To my Russian friends who talk about using nuclear weapons in Ukraine, you need to understand that would be an attack on NATO itself, given Ukraine's proximity to NATO territory, Graham emphasized.